And so our work is centered intentionally in working with um, young girls, young women of color, and women in general, because we want to uplift the narrative, voices, and ideas and thoughts of women of color. And we want to dismantle the white dominant culture description of what a black woman looks like, what a woman looks like, and what a young girl would look like. It talks about narrative power. And the idea of narrative power is that you tell your story and that's the truth, that's your truth. And the idea of taking that back um, and using that um, as you move forward and to empower yourself is that, you know, you get to tell your own story and no one can tell your story like you. And so we work with young girls to um, really understand um, who they are, who they want to be in their life, and then to kind of be authentic in that. I just remember at that age not knowing much. If you don't have siblings or you know, you're at different stages in your life, your friends are going through different things, and it, it feels good to be around other kids your age um, and just to interact. Um, but I think it was, it was amazing watching the girls interact with each other, come at, coming out of their shell and actually telling us what was going on, things they don't tell their parents. And um, just realizing that there's a huge generational gap versus when I was young and what they're going through now. So I think it's just very important that we, um, we center around black and brown girls because a lot of times we don't see that and that's not a focus in our society. So it's important that we are, we're always tapping in and making sure that our girls are doing well. I love the young women. I love um, the value placed. They enjoy um, receiving feedback and giving feedback as far as, you know, just even the program that we have in here as well. Um, just giving what we learned as women and filling in the gaps of what we didn't have as young women growing up that we had to like find in other resources and other places, sometimes in the wrong places. Um, we now get to feed them and they are very receptive and that feels really